Back where we have Vinata. Where we left off, we have this fat boy that's going to die. The Shunga. Oh, I see. Be strong for mother is still wanting to sleep. <laughs> I love how it just says be, be strong, strong for, for dot mother. dot dot. <laughs> <laughs> uh, be strong so, for mother. What do you think is like the like dumbest movie antagonist what? that you've ever In like seen? Dumbest movie antagonist? Yeah, yeah, like the dumbest like antagonist that you can think of from whatever movie. You know, kind of like where the villain's kind of stupid and does something that like completely screws him over and doesn't realize it. What the hell? Who vomited? Oh, I hate this them mother. Oh, it's past a minute. Fucker. <laughs> this mm, past a minute. Fuck. Who's being haunted? You? What are you eating? You son of a bitch! I just got him! Fuck you! Get out of here! That's my <laughs> dinner! Oh, I did now. Now. Strong for mother. It's up to you to eat this motherfucker before someone else eats him! Is he just floating? No. Be strong kind of for mother. Don't worry about his Here you go. What the hell happened to you? Oh, god damn it, not again. Wait, have I planted that before? That one looks new. I'll let that one grow. Oh my god, it's a cactus. It's a pear. Oh, I thought it was a Venus flytrap or something. Oh. Venus flytraps don't have spikes. No, they weed. don't, but they have <laughs> nice. like, those tendrils. Not really tendrils, but you know. Hurry up and grow so I can kill you. Are you done? <laughs> nope. You're done. And in the background, we can see <laughs> murder. Be strong for murder. Oh my god, he made fucking three seeds. Oh, damn these weeds. They really act like weeds. Oh, you bitch. That's why they're. Now proceed with the question I asked. I asked you like an hour ago. What was it? <laughs> What, have, in your opinion, who is like the dumbest antagonist of a movie or show or pretty much anything? Okay, dumbest antagonist. On the movie. Morning. Put it in. Frog? In there. You bought a frog? Congrats. Uh, yeah. Okay, so. Is a tartridge expensive? I don't know. Kind of. Yeah. Wanna... Let's Six hundred. Is this done growing fruit? No. Okay. Dumbest antagonist from a movie. Or show. Show. Yeah, so that way, so that way, it gives you more of a variety. If you can't really think of one or the other one, like off the top of your head or something. <clears throat> I'm gonna say this one person, but they're not really an antagonist. Um, well, I guess it doesn't have to be a main antagonist. But if there's some sort of way, like a villain or like a side villain. I mean, God, what the hell is that show called? It's like. I don't know. It's a dude with a fucking lizard for a head. Lizard head. Not a lizard for a head. There's a difference. Uh, it's probably one of the only shows where I liked all the characters. The protagonist, the antagonist. Guy with the... <laughs> Is it called like Dororo or something like that? I think so. Who's being hunted now? I'm gonna pour water on your fucking head. You hate it. <laughs> I don't think I'm familiar with what you're talking about. I don't think I've ever seen it. But, uh, there's the main bad guy, which his ability is very similar to what you were talking about in the last episode. Is it called Doro He Doro? Does he have a lizard head? 
Oh, fuck, there's well, the sh I, I just started Googling, like, shows Dora whatever lizard head, <laughs> and that's what it popped up with. Does he have a lizard head? Uh, better, better, better yet, I'll just send a picture. Is this what you're talking about? Literally, you just need to answer the question. Does he have a lizard? Yeah, he, yeah, yes, he, does, that have, is he it. does have a lizard. Uh, hey, I, you don't know how many shows hey! or whatever have a guy with a lizard head. Fucking There's a lot. Uh, but yeah, that's it. The main bad guy has the special ability of mushrooms. <laughs> okay, is that it? Pretty much. He can breathe, and his breath grows mushrooms. And I guess whatever he touches can also grow mushrooms if he chooses. He makes mushrooms. That sounds like a weird form of like molding or decay or something like that. Kind of, except it's solely mushrooms, and his main source of god fuck of oh my god, how many ruffians am I gonna get? Too many. <laughs> his main his main meals are mushrooms. Oh no! Weird. Oh, Ruffy is on the way. Okay. <laughs> I'd have to probably say uh, for me. Uh, but wait, no, I wasn't done yet. Um. Oh, go on. <laughs> Pretty much so breathing mushrooms. Oh, I'm water a fucking weed. Uh, yeah. So there's that guy, but he's not the one that I was talking about. There are other antagonists, which motherfucking son of a bitch, which aren't the main antagonist, because the main antagonist is that mushroom dude. But these guys are like mercenaries, but they're also fucking stupid. Oh yeah. But in general, <laughs> they're not like stupid to where they fuck up their work or anything. They're not like clumsy or anything. They're just mentally stupid. Don't eat the fucking shit! I swear to God, Chick-fil-A, you're gonna turn into Chick-fil-A if you eat it. <laughs> yeah, see, now you can eat it. Yeah, see, now you yeah like, they're, they're, they're kind of stupid, but they're good at their job in a way. Yeah. Oh my fucking God, where? Oh, yeah, that you kinda, farty that does, bitch! That does kind of sound, sound about right. So, I have a feeling you're gonna talk about Mansley because he's a complete fucking dumbass. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I, yeah. I'm sorry, I just haven't seen a villain who's as stupid as he is, as an antagonist. WHERE'S THE GIANT MANSLEY?! <laughs> Looks back. What's up? WHERE'S THE GIANT oh. MANSLEY?! Uh, I, I I know there's a bunker away from here, we can get there! No, you fucking moron, that's too far. It's like, dude, you just launched a warhead. MONEY! Uh, yeah, a warhead out of town, full of military dudes, and random civilians, and your bright idea is to shoot the giant with a nuclear warhead, who's standing like 30 oh yards away from you. Not even that. Why is giant weirdly? It's just the oh shit. <laughs> like oh, so oh no. Want to hear some? Honey? Dude definitely <laughs> went to federal prison after that. <laughs> he, pro he, he probably did. He very much had to. Have. Probably for like an act of terrorism. I can't. Yeah, you know I mean, I mean, yeah, that probably would be about right. He did tell them to launch a nuclear warhead at their own people. Why is that blue? What the fuck? I've never seen that before. Um, maybe they allow same-sex relationship. What the fuck? Why is it blue? <laughs> Even the worm is blue. Everyone's so, blue. That is brought just because we kind of got on the think. whole Mansley thing. Um, I think it was due to an ankle. Maybe. You you know the multiverses game, right? The Warner Brothers version of like a, I guess a battle royale or like and Super now, Smash Bros. Yeah. Be strong to matter. Or I, I think and... the one probably the one of the my favorite things that came out of it was just the factor that the Iron Giant actually had some sort of Sex. um inter no interaction with oh. Superman because he was like obsessed with it. Yeah, I'm gonna be <laughs> Superman. Superman's like, what is this fucking garbage can talking to me? <laughs> Superman. Ah, oh, fuck, not this again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that. I just watched some birds step on the board. <laughs> and you just hear it go, oh! The, the fuck is a loather? Okay, I just need two. <laughs> the whole stepping on the worm thing reminds me of a random commercial I saw today. Well, I guess not really a random commercial, but it was like an advertisement. For um, like a roofing or like a ceiling company, and a whole the whole thing starts out with like two geckos or lizards like oh, yes. being romantically in love, 
And then yeah. the root ceiling starts cracking. And then the one lover falls Grab to my the hand. death onto a, like, chess board. And three dudes are like, oh my god, Hey, what the fled. fuck, man? Why didn't you repair your roof? Look at him, he's crying! <laughs> yeah, the, 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 it's just, why didn't you use this? Now they're all dead. It's like, what? The, this took a turn for, like, the most, like, dark... Yeah, like commercial. I don't know if it's so Japanese or if it's just Asian it's, in general, it, but uh, I think it's like a Japanese thing, maybe. It's, it's those type of commercials and just like. Some I mean, it's fucking... it's creative. I'll give it that. It gives some kind of creative and like kind of a bit of a comedy to it. They're it's like fucking... a dark comedy. Oh, the same fucking. This is. They're hypnotizing. Oh yeah, <laughs> it really oh, is. He's flying for my it's This type of fucking. Okay. Oh man, these are kinky. Dude. These guys are kinky. <laughs> Would this be considered a four-way? Oh, that's complete submissive. <laughs> and now, right, and now, God, why we have so much shit. Get their egg. Uh, God, I need it. Okay, I became a romancer for those morons. All right, stupid ass worms, keep romancing. You're not done fucking yet. That's what you think. They're already done with you. You watched Doctor Who, haven't you? Uh, depends on the doctors, but yeah. Well, either way, are you familiar with like any or uh, well, how many of the Doctor Who variants are you familiar with? Ah, uh, the recent ones. So, fucking, I don't know. <laughs> they're like it's like Doctor Ten, and basically they're numbered essentially in a weird way. Right. Um. I just want to know, for the fun of it, who is your favorite Doctor Who? I don't know his number, but he was the best. Um, is he like British and like God very off the it. off Not the like the again. chain cr like crazy? What do you mean? He was the He's one like that he cut off his hand and regenerated it. Not familiar with that. Fuck. Okay, I'm not just, familiar just with look that, up. Doctor. I haven't actually up, seen uh, it. Look up Doctor Who regenerating his hands, and they'll show you the one that I'm talking about. Am I big hatch? I have brain damage. Oh, for apparently you. that was the tenth Doctor. Yeah. Okay, so the one that I was thinking of was the ninth. So ones that I know of are nine, ten, and eleven. But ten is my favorite. I have to say, uh, if I'm correct on the number here, I think it's the 11th Doctor is my favorite one. Yeah, he's the one that's off the rails batshit insane. Yeah. <laughs> he's he's batshit crazy. He's gotta be my favorite one. Fucking when they <laughs> Just... change Doctors from 10 to 11, he's like, I don't want to go. Immediate change. Alright, I need to figure out what my favorite foods are right now! <laughs> I got this! I, I, he starts I, eating I, a bunch I, of shit, and he's like, nope, I hate that. Okay, moving on. <laughs> Move it on, I'm gonna find something myself. Fish sticks and custard. What? <laughs> I, I I never actually full blown watched it myself, but I do watch like clips of it here and there and I I get a kick I get a real kick out of the eleventh doctor just because he's like bad shit crazy. I mean hey, like, starting at oh, the ninth. Hey, did and going you just on? bring the bag? Did you did he just get them to leave and then he just bring a bag? <laughs> Dude, some of those episodes are fucked up. Like the fucking one word of Oh god the where it's like take place in like World War Two, World War One, I, I don't know, and like there's like an infection going around that makes your face grow a gas mask that merges with your skin. I don't know, it's fucked up, and it was a weird. That sounds, that sounds like some sort of chemical warfare, though. Yeah. Was the thing. Their face grew into a gas mask, so it looks like a gas mask that you're wearing, but it's not. It's merged with your head. It is your head. It's weird. Ah. I don't hurry think I'm up and be with excited so I can give you brain damage. I think, in my opinion, the most interesting, <laughs> but one of the more Woo! interesting. You guys don't get to see it. But I'd say, like maybe one of the more interesting episodes that I've seen, or is the uh, the Weeping Angels. Mmm. Where it's like they're uh, what was the word he used? Whoops. They're you know, like quantum, quantum, dimension, quantum, quantum whatever, line, quantum yeah. lock. It's where, like, if you look at... They're, like, pretty much like Peanut from SCP. Yeah. But in, it's, like, in a different twist. <clears throat> they literally yeah. genetically turn into, like, concrete statues and, like, shit when you look at them. 
But outside of that, they're like flesh and blood when you're not looking at them. Oh, that's great. Yeah, I got a kick out of that episode, just like those episodes, because it was like a random but like a cool idea. Yeah. I'm probably gonna get into Doctor Who a bit more and actually watch some of those. My natural talent meant oh, great, Gardner. I feel yeah. like that's now less than that same level. A professional gardener, but okay. <laughs> what were you gonna say, Mr. Dark? My favorite doctor is the fourth and the tenth. Hell yeah. The tenth one I did like how like kinda like how he looked at least. I didn't really watch too many of the episodes, but oh, I know I've so seen good. a couple of the Weeping Angel ones, and I think he was pretty good. I don't know why he was running away from the Weeping Angels. When they catch you, the only thing they do is transport you randomly through time. He can literally transport through time. What's the problem? Um, they actually kill you. They they don't like just randomly teleport you through time. Oh god, they, it's like, a toilet. Consume... I think they like absorb your life energy or something like the that. Teeth. Oh, he eats eggs. That's not good for what I'm doing. <laughs> mm, mm, yes, yes. And let me guess, he's not a snake. All right. Oh my god, he's <laughs> the fucking pinata is already massive. <laughs> I did not expect him to grow up so soon. So we are just going to keep the camera off of him until he's ready. Well, then I guess you better be quick about it. <clears throat> I cannot speed up his development. He's currently undergoing metamorphosis. He is turning into a metamorphosis of ice. Wow, but yeah, I was pretty confident like the weeping angels just like full blown kill you. Yeah, I don't think Time. <laughs> I think that might be oh, something else. Him. Maybe a bit of both. It's just far Who knows? Me. Didn't the fucking Doctor Who's hand that got cut off just also grow into another Doctor Who? Uh, yeah, that's an interesting like concept, actually. And yeah, something uh, like that. So, isn't it canonical that Doctor Who has two hearts? Oh, yeah. No, that's very true. He has, like, multiple hearts, I believe. Okay, because I think the clone only had one. Why are you blue? Why is everyone blue? What the fuck is happening here? Uh, it's because of you? You're not even in the garden. It doesn't make sense. And they're fine. What the hell? I got a kick out of just like every time that the hey! doctor changed, he was like, these aren't my teeth. It was like the first instinct he said, these aren't my teeth. They feel different. <laughs> oh, jeez. Thanks. Get your fucking stinky ass out of here. No, I did not say get enraged and pick a fight with someone. I said get the hell out of here. Do it again. Oh my god, these fucking tools. You stop dying for five seconds. You're the ones that planted yourselves, and now you're whining at me. <laughs> Ain't that the truth, though? Egg delivered. Why did she? Did she just crash land? <laughs> she fell from the sky. She or just hit. Ooh, that was overwater. Drag gum fly. Where you is it? Made he? a gum. What is that? that? Oh, ice crystal. He's fucking it looks stuck. Like ice. Done. <laughs> oh gee, thanks. <laughs> well done. He's trapped forever. Fuck him. <laughs> he, he's oh, trapped thanks. forever. Who cares? <laughs> Is he fucking done yet? Oh yeah, he's done. <laughs> All right. Are you guys finally ready to see the new boy? There. Yeah. Or he's got some serious brain damage. Oh yeah, he turned into a four man. He <laughs> turned into a four-man crew. Yeah, so this one, it's not even, like... Um, this is not even my yeah, final is, form! This isn't a yeah, three-way anymore. This is uh, this is a straight-up orgy. If he has sex... Well, Mr. Dark gets to name him. It was his kids. Child. Offsprings. Whatever you want to call them. Um, no. That's not how that works. That only works <laughs> if the creature... Ate another creature and turned into a different creature. And, and what that does creature this guy that do? Ate was... Hey! I don't 
want to hit him because he's just going to laugh Andy at me and then he's fucking going to do more damage. Get out of here. Uh, who was the last one to name? Um. What? Let's see here. What did you do? Hey! God, fucking damn it! Son of a bitch. Let's see here. I did the bird, I did that, Mr. Dark, and then it went to me. Oh, that and then you. see. I think I'm it's Mr. Dark. So again. glad I have this friend here. Ah! Yeah, no, you Dark's son of a bitch! Again. Okay, I now know that I need to yeah. extend the fence. <laughs> yeah, no, you fucked up. Give that dickhead way more money. Ah, sh shit. <laughs> What's up with that guy? Okay, He's never winning. mind. Fucking asshole. Great, I love spending a bunch of money. I just got this guy, you fucking bitch! Why don't you just build, like, a giant fence around him? What the fuck? Like, around the area. Because that also clocks out the wild ones, I assume. Uh, it probably is right, actually. That would make sense. <laughs> I think Cannon's trying to process what just happened. Ooh. Yeah, I'm definitely processing it, because I'm not sure how to feel about it. Uh, in the wise words of Doom Guy, rip and tear. Huh. Yes, you A lot. Said searing white rage, but I'm not sure. Hmm. Okay. So. Yeah. Right. Hmm. Right. <laughs> right. So. Not yeah. seething with rage so at all. Hmm. <laughs> what I could ascertain from that situation is he won the duel. And assimilated my pinata into coins, and then stole the coin. Which doesn't make any sense because there's only one ruffian that can kill your pinatas, which is Professor uh. Pester. Which is why he's such a big deal, because he's the only one that can kill your pinata. Maybe he lended yeah, yeah. the power. But, uh, usually ruffians will get into a fight with pinatas, and then 90% of the time they'll win, making your pinata sick, which you need to call a doctor for, otherwise they will die. Uh, I mean, not yeah. that they will be assimilated entirely. And so happy that as soon as I get one extremely expensive pinata fucking four ruffian show <laughs> professor best <laughs> being counted as one yeah that's f ridiculous So, to take out some aggression, I'm going to poison my frog and uh, beat the shit out of him. Is there a, an advantage to this, or are you just doing it out of spite? This is a nightshade berry. Yeah, nightshade berry. Uh, oh, they're extreme... There goes vacuum. <laughs> Don't eat this vacuum. 
They're extremely poisonous. Oh, I think I know what you're going to make here. Poison tree frog! And basically, it's... what I'm gonna do... Yeah, I don't care that you're fucking... Oh my fucking god. If you don't eat this fucking berry and you get scared by him again, I'm gonna make him eat you because he wants to. Check. <laughs> Where is he? I mean, that is quite the threat. Yeah, Red Hot, I have a feeling the other one is... Oh, great. Now you eat it. Man, Stop can't it. you... I can't wait for Pirates of the Caribbean, what, like six? <laughs> I don't know. I lost count. <laughs> I actually oh. wonder if they've actually made any announcements about that. I doubt they have. Voila. When you feed... Oh, my God, he's so fast. When you feed a lick of toad, a poisonous berry, and then Lock the shit out of him, he becomes a lactate. He's not lactating. Now, we still need to name the other snake, which, unfortunately, will not be the snake number one. It'll be snake number two that we will be naming. All right. So, who's naming the toad? Hmm. Hermit, but spell it with a K. No, C. <laughs> His name's already spelled with a K. What the fuck? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> spell it with a C instead. Sermit. <laughs> Exactly, Sermit. <laughs> yes, exactly. Well, then how do Sermit I spell this? <laughs> what are you trying to spell? <laughs> that right? And then... Permit suicide. I don't know if we should be making jokes about that. I think that's going to get you in trouble. Uh, that's not what I said, though. I said Q-aside. There you go. Now you can get away with it. You don't want to turn out like Logan Paul. Oh, Where's it? My fucking Who was it? God. Kermit suicide. <laughs> this guy's already getting to a fucking fight. Stop it. You do not <laughs> want me to be angry at a target right now. <laughs> Completely, totally, like, beat the crap out of him. Because <laughs> right now, it's just general anger, so do not Fair make enough. me have targeted anger, because I have a lot <laughs> stored. Probably. That makes sense. <laughs> ruffians. More like a couple of murderers! So, as far as, like, Pirates of the Caribbean goes, just because I want to know, like, your input. So, you're, obviously, I already can assume you're aware, like, the whole like power I wouldn't say it's a power struggle but the who who really quote should have the rights to being the captain of the Black Pearl between Jack and Barbosa. Right. So in your opinion, which one do you th believe should have like right like the actual right to be captain? Instead of it being like a disagreement back and forth. Oops. Um Hold on. If you need to get rid of him, go ahead and get rid of him. <laughs> he's causing that much problems. I believe he's crying over there. He is, dude. He totally <laughs> is. Wow. Wow, dude, you're abusive. Well, he was the target. Yeah, see, look how fuck it! Okay. Got you. You got it. Got it. Bang, bang. Okay, singing idiot. I will sell you. Get off the fucking house. Yeah, I don't care if you're unhappy. And you. Oh my god, he's fucking moth. What are you muffing about? Okay, so you named this creature, right? Yeah, I named him. So it's up to you on what am I doing. It was like smog on mango. What are the options? Uh, let it die, sell it, pack it. What's the options? 
Just pack him. Put, send him on vacation. Pack him. Fine. Yes. I went off. What the hell is that? I guess we'll have to tune in next time for when Cannon absolutely murders half of the fucking zoo. It's a garden. Yes. Nope. It's a zoo. Hold on. Let me check this board. I want to see if this is working yet. Yeah. What's the board supposed to tell you? It's supposed to tell me something really important once it fucking works. Worm. Fuck again. The starters is here. Big babies. Okay. Here yet. I have so many sour pinatas. You know what? Next episode, we gotta focus on sour pinatas. Collect okay. all the heart. Shut up! Okay, uh, to the next time for sour. For Canon Sour Hour. Yeah, I like that.